got a serious one northbound there on the uh, Brent Spence Bridge. Dan, take it away. Yeah, and it's right here at the north end of the bridge. You've got the one car there with very heavy damage, and then another car back here. Look at the heavy damage on that car as well. So first responders are working on getting people out of both of those cars. So an accident with injuries in those. And what they've done is they, they've shut down those two right-hand lanes, and they've left two left-hand lanes open to get by. And that is really helping uh, sort of ease this backup situation. You know you're going to get a backup whenever you get a wreck on the bridge, but I was looking at it just a second ago, and you go back here to the cut in the hill, and traffic was moving down the cut in the hill. Let's zoom in here just a little bit and see how you're just sort of creeping down the cut in the hill there. So with those two left lanes open, I don't know if taking a detour is really going to help all that much. They are going to need wreckers in there, so even though they're working on getting that cleaned up pretty quickly, it's still going to be a little while. So this situation will be with us probably for another uh, half hour, 45 minutes or so. I'm Dan Carroll in Chopper 9.